we are the Scottish Falsetto Sock Puppet Theatre and so am I and so is he. And we have one name on our lips. What's that name? Penelope Scotland Dysick. Penelope Scotland Dysick. Yeah, isn't that the answer to the question, what do you get if you take the leading female character from Thunderbirds to Glasgow and make her paint pools of vomit with the face paint that Braveheart used to use? Well, that would give you the name Tintin Socky Hall Street Tint Vomit. Oh, yes, it would. No, Penelope Scotland Dysick is the new baby daughter of Courtney Kardashian. Is that a daughter? I hope it's a daughter. Although, given the fact that she can't spell the name Courtney properly, anything is popular. Is, is that the stupidest name ever given to a celebrity baby? Well, let's find out as we have a look at the top 10 stupidest celebrity baby names. At number 10, Penelope Scotland Dysick. Only at number 10. Well, given that her first name's quite normal and her middle name is where we come from, the only funny thing about it is her family name. And you know what they say about families? Oh yeah, you can pick your friends, you can pick your nose, but you can't pick your friend's nose. Close enough. And number nine, Ireland Baldwin. Ireland Baldwin, yeah. Alec Baldwin and Kim Bassinger. Why is Scotland a less stupid middle name than Ireland is a first name? Don't know, just is. And Prince Charles does sign himself as Wales, which suggests he might be an idiot. And true fact, I did once know somebody called Isla White, so maybe it's just normal. Uh, number seven, who is it? Um, and number seven, Jason Lee, out of My Name is Earl, called his son Pilot Inspector. Pilot Inspector with a K? Well, of course with a K. Inspector with a C would have just been seen. And number seven, and number seven, Apple. Apple, yes. Chris Martin and Gwyneth Paltrow, what were you thinking? Well, P.G. Woodhouse's name was Plum. That was a nickname. P.G. Woodhouse's name was Nick. To save time, yes. And at number six, it's Jermaine Jackson, whose son or daughter, yeah, possibly a daughter, is called Your Majesty. Your Majesty is a pretty nice girl, but she doesn't have a lot to say until she's a teenager, when she will have more to say than most because she'll be able to say, I hate you and you're not my parents. And number five, oh, it's Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson, whose son or daughter, it really is hard to tell, is called Blanket. Blanket, although, to be fair, when he did give them the name Blanket, it did achieve total coverage result. Thank you. And at number four, the fourth stupid celebrity baby name is a tie between, it's a tie between Sarah Palin and Sarah Palin, who has one child called Track and one child called Trig. Boys or girls? Oh, I hope they're girls. Then one of them could marry called, someone called e Otomy and someone called e o Nometry, and they'd become Trig e Otomy and Track o Nometry. That didn't work. And number three, it's Nicholas Cage, who has called his son Cal L. Cal L. Yeah, is that? The orange juice they used to serve in cinema. So close. No, Kal-El is the Kryptonian name for Superman. Is it? Yeah. That is like wanting to call your child after Spider-Man and instead of calling him Peter, calling him Radioactive Spider. Oh God, I hope there's no celebrities watching. Stay tuned for Radioactive Spider Rooney. Who's at number two? At number two, not one, not two, but three names, all courtesy of Frank Zappa. Frank Zappa, yep. Yeah. Frank Zappa named his kids Dweezel, Moon Unit, and Diva Finn Muffin. Crazy man, crazy, why, that will have ruined their lives worse than a boy named, you know that child in a boy named Sue, whose dad called him, whatever he called him, oh, whatever it was, it made him mental. Well, it was over 40 years ago that Frank Zappa called his kids that. Diva and Moon Unit are successful actors. Dweezel is an award-winning guitarist. Whether they'd have got that far in the civil service or chartered accountancy is a different matter. That's right. Think on, you reckless parents, which leaves us only with the number one. It does. And the most stupid celebrity baby name of all time is... Dun, da, 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 drum roll. Drum roll would have been more sensible a name than this. The most stupid name is Moxie Crime Fighter. Moxie Crime Fighter. Yes, Penn Gillette. And his wife, whose name is Gillette G2, probably, probably called their kid Moxie Crime Fighter, boy or girl, I'm past caring. They called her Moxie Pro Crime Fighter Gillette because they said nobody uses their middle name. 
What about the moxie bit? Moxie is named after an American fizzy drink that's been around since 1876 and is orange coloured, slightly bitter and more popular in the north than the south. You mean, it's like yes. Naming your child Moxie is the direct equivalent of calling a child Iron Brew. Although, yeah, this is a fact, there are three children in Scotland who have been christened Iron Brew. God help us. We are the very sensibly named Scottish falsetto sock puppet theatre. And so am I and so is he. Thank you. Good night. Good night. By the way, the calendar is still available on the website.